My Leo stars, hi Leo Seeker, welcome, welcome, welcome to 2019. I'm the Ministress of Magic here. So happy to have you here. Thank you for your trust. Welcome to the Existential Shift. As you can see, 13 um, packs on the table from January to December. One significance, two clarifiers, and a rune. And this symbolizes the entirety of the year, the 13th pack. A little bit of Palo Santo. Breathe in, breathe out, so we can start. We will finish up with um, Akashic Records Oracle and with an I Ching. All right. Say hello to cilantro and basil, by the way. <laughs> okay, guys, so mixing the cards was super elegant. You are very focused. You are very clear-minded. I can already tell the energy of reading by the way the cards are being shuffled and come out. So I'm looking forward to see what come what what we're getting. But I feel I feel you being your royal you, Leo. I feel a lot of power and elegance. So what I'm going to do, we're going to start with the significance of the entire 2019. This will be the conclusion. And then we'll go month to, month by month. Okay, are we ready? All right, so the first of all, the rune, I already know what it is because of the shape. So once I pull it out of the sack, I already know it is weird. The 25th rune, the empty rune, the rune of the destiny, of the fate, of the unknown, the things that are beyond our control. So that's 2019 for us. <laughs> Dramatic start, huh? Wow, the lovers. Aries had the lovers as well. This is a very meaningful year where you're going to walk a path that is very destined. Even if seemingly there's a choice, maybe you've already made the choice and now you're walking it with clarity of mind because this is the after tarot when we see one step further from the card. So here there's already the, the couple on the lovers card are, are touching each other. Okay, so this could be a destined union, for example. I like the start. Four of Swords and the Death card. Two fours already. Okay, so you need to allow things to unfold and play the and play as it goes, okay? The death, the lovers, especially with weird, so it's higher forces this year that are leading you, um, Leo. And I feel you being very uh, receptive to it. You're allowing yourself to take time and not take actions um, to listen to the guidance. You see how she's holding the sword here? And here the angel is holding the sword. I feel especially the feminine, the divine feminine here is really guided towards a certain union or a certain destiny. Okay, this is a very um, intense reading. Lovely. This is going to be a very meaningful year for you guys, and someone is really fulfill, fulfilling a destiny. This might be um, what, what we like to uh, refer to as twin flame story, because whatever union this is, it's, it's, it's supposed to... Um, so it's a very deep soulmate connection with a purpose, with a higher purpose. Um, Okay, there's also this can also be a very dramatic events that happens either to you or someone your a significant other, someone you really love or close to you that keeps you close to them. You know, and um, there's an element of caring for someone, of being there for someone. Um, and the two of you or one of you is going through something um, that is bigger than you that feels very um, meaningful and this will really strengthen a certain bond okay this I can already tell this is going to be a very spiritual very deep year and reading for you guys just the significator rune is intense. Um, you you will be answering a calling this year, Leo. 
I, I recommend to not fight it. I truly recommend to not fight it. Some of you, whatever battles you have gone through in the past, everything that you've learned, all the knowledge that you've uh, accumulated was literally meant for this year in order to help you manifest something. To start, you're taking a whole new path in your life right now and you feel like it's bigger than you and something about you, you're, you intuitively know that it's the time to let go of the cognitive aspect of your decision making and you're and just listening to the divine you need to be guided by the divine this year leo um okay <laughs> let's go to january and see what this is all about shall we wow okay i i'm also getting the rest of the warrior Someone is healing from something or resting for something in order to gather strength to do something that they were always meant to do. Leo, what is going on? Okay, you ready? January. 